an extra video here. This video is about you know a volcanic eruption that happened many centuries ago, and the fact that you can find this in museums. Keep in mind, respect the dead, leave them where they're at. I always will remember when I always say that. Make sure you do leave bodies alone. Today, I want to discuss something of uh on how the person did suffer in history. Here's the title of it. Ancient Rome. So, as you can see, we're going to see this real quick. Those people, uh, you know, during the excavation, sometimes the archaeologists... Alright guys, this body that you're seeing right here, I'm going to tell you something real quick. His position, the way he was left, not many people will understand this, but this is exactly how they really felt. So as we get a little through, I'm going to show you something real quick. Under the volcanic material, some empty spaces left by the decomposition of the bodies. So what they did, they injected the liquid plasmids in these empty spaces. This is how I know. When you look at the face... It does describe how painful it was when he went through it. No thought about it. He knew it was so painful and yet he took it. The position, the way he was left, he was probably the only one who had it to take the pain. But the expression on the man's face right here is definitely describing that how painful it was what he went through. And of course, anybody would actually express this. And this is one of Lucifer's work that he caused them to be punished by God's hands. Keep in mind, Lucifer has always wanted humanity to fail. And this was one of the punishments because of Lucifer and the bad decision that he sent. Now, remember, what these guys went through in history, either woman or man, their reaction in their face is enough to say how painful it was but there is one more I want to show you how this one suffered way more this one I felt like he was being strong about it when he took the pain that's how you know he didn't put much of a struggle on it but this one did allow me to take you to it the liquid plasma took the form of the previous bodies and when it dried up the archaeologists cleaned all the ash away keep in mind not everybody knows the true history of this this guy I kind of uh, had a obvious that he was an older man keep in mind you can still see the the best future in his face he was an older man probably around 60 years old you can tell and I know you're probably thinking how can you tell he's a statue doesn't matter the way he looks definitely describes he was an older man around 60 or maybe younger but this the, his position this guy suffered very badly look how his arms are extended he was definitely begging for the pain to stop if I can visit these locations I can tell you exactly if the person suffered or not and the thing this is what Lucifer wants to happen for humanity they suffered and now he wants this generation to suffer next that's changing but I thought I'd kind of give you guys a little glimpse of what I'm seeing. This guy suffered so bad. He wanted it. He wanted the pain to stop. He was begging for mercy. That's why this position definitely says a lot. But I hope you guys enjoy this of what I noticed. Besides, I love history more than anything. But yeah. But anyways, may God be, may uh, Jesus Christ be with you. May God be with you too. Amen.